We're entering the final weekend of Black Restaurant Week. Many locally owned restaurants are participating in the event, offering deals on their best meals. I'm all smiles now because we've got food here. Yeah. If you want to support a small business, get out there soon because Sunday is the last day. And joining us this morning, one of the participants of the event, Flava Wings owner Krishna Buford. Good morning. Good morning. Oh my gosh, what did you bring? Oh, lots of goodies, lots of goodies. So we, you have a wings restaurant. It, we are primarily our specialty is wings, wings okay. but we also have turkey, we have duck, ah. and of course tenders and boneless as well. Which explains this giant wing over yeah. here. That <laughs> exactly, is turkey. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. It is massive. Exactly, and it's so delicious. It's moist, it's perfectly fried to perfection. I'll tell you what, it smells amazing. The sauces, and you were telling us everything's homemade. We make everything in-house. Wow. We make everything in-house, and that's what makes us different. Yeah. Because we prepare all of our orders fresh. Love so that. we don't just fry up a bunch of stuff and just leave it sitting there. We make everything fresh to order. So when the ticket comes, the food is dropped. Yeah. I'm actually somebody who I, I no longer do a whole bunch of spicy foods. Mm -hmm. You've got a big range, you got sweet, you got mild. We have all of that. We have sweet, we have savory, we have spicy, we have 13 flavors. We have uh, 10 wet and three dry rubs, which is the lemon pepper here and the goodness garlic parmesan, two examples of that. Right here in the middle, guys, mm -hmm. that's what she's talking about. Now another fan favorite is our Cajun corn. And now this one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Which is just so delicious. It's also fried. We love fried things at places. You fry the corn <laughs> right on the We fry the corn oh, right on the I cob. I don't know if I've even wow. had fried corn. It's it is good. delicious. It is one of your producers, it's it's his favorite. Oh, oh. wow. <laughs> Renee? Yeah, that's yeah, Renee. Yeah. That's Renee. <laughs> so how has Black Restaurant Week been helping you guys? Well, you know, Black Restaurant Week, that organization embraced us mm -hmm. from our very mm -hmm. first year. Um, so this is our fourth year with them. So this was and COVID times. This was COVID wow. times. We opened Boy, right at the peak of COVID. So initially, we couldn't even have people dine in. It was strictly pickup only. Yeah. Oh, and, wow. and it was a very interesting time. There was an interesting dynamic going on across the country um, in addition to COVID, which actually I think was part of the reason why we've had the boost of success mm -hmm. that we've so had. So it helped you succeed. It helped us succeed. Wow, because people came to get their to-go orders and yeah. then realized, hey, you guys are worth coming back to. Exactly, yeah. exactly. Oh, nice. And Black Restaurant Week, I, I would have to think, they helped to introduce us to Houston. Yeah. Houston has a very diverse food scene. Yeah. Yes, and, massive. And um, massive. There are so many, so many options out there, but I have to believe that because Black Restaurant Week embraced us so early on that that had a lot to do with our early success. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's a really great point. And, mm -hmm. you know, you, you look back in, in Sadly, unfortunately, not everybody was able to adapt to that model during COVID yeah, and they had to true. close their doors. So to yeah, see yeah. a success story come out of that, that really is incredible. For people interested in stopping by mm -hmm. your, your location, where is it? Tell us all about well, we it. We have two locations. Oh, We're wow. a growing franchise. I love that. And we cool. have two locations. Our first location is uh, 7395 McCard Road in Houston. And then our second location is 13646 Bissonette Street okay. in um, A Leaf area, the okay. West Houston area. Area. Good for mm -hmm. you. Okay, okay, quickly, because we're going to have to go soon. What are your most popular flavors? Our most popular is the ooey sweet and sticky by far. This is the ooey sweet and sticky, um, followed by our banging bourbon black pepper and the zesty lemon pepper. Those are fan favorites. And some of them true. are dry. dry huh? yep, yeah, some of dry them are rubs. dry. We've got the three dry rubs. And and this is two of them. I, Krishna, I have a question for you. Can you purchase the sauces or the rubs in the, the restaurants? Well, yeah, you can. Yeah. Um, She's like, you, they're you a can. secret. So. <laughs> <laughs> we, we don't sell it in batches okay. yet. Yet. Okay. Yet. But um, yes, you can. So it's it. just because you don't make large batches, not because it's like some family secret recipe or something? Or well, Maybe it's both. kind of a mixture of both. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know what? If you say that you saw her here, <laughs> you might get a little something extra something. there. Krishna <laughs> awesome. Buford, thank you so much for coming in. Thanks we for appreciate having your time us. this morning. Thank that was you. great. Good luck. Thank at you Black very much. For the end of Black Restaurant yeah. Week. <laughs>